It's really no joke that an actor shot President Lincoln. No, it's not. And yet we laughed, as actors do, chatting before Beginners Act Two, Polonius, the ghost, and the first gravedigger, setting aside our thespic rigor, as mordant a trio as trot the boards. The ghost, you see, had visited Fords, and there was the box, and there was the stage, which unsuspecting in another age Lincoln had watched till the fatal shot took his attention from the plot, and Booth, in a part to tear a cat in, leapt box to stage and spoke in Latin, break a leg, Mr. Booth. In fact, he did but managed to flee, and then he hid at a doctor's house who set his limb, one Dr. Mudd, who marvelled at him, who, performing, had managed to break a bone and ridden for half an hour alone. Do you not know of a doctor nearer? Yes, said Booth. It was Dr. Theatre, and the thrill and all the adrenaline of the finest show I've ever been in. In fact, he killed, as we actors say, the biggest laugh in the whole damn play. No sense of comedy, John Wilkes booze. Till then the show was running smooth, no sense of comedy booze at all. Beginners, part two, this is your call. And we turn to think in the self-same breath of Hamlet again and our nearness to death. Polonius, ghost, and first grave digger, maybe each wishing his part were bigger, the murderous booth not anywhere near so frustrated. Although by Hamlet now we're sated by a hundred and fifty nights so long, we prepare ourselves to go back on, for tragedy is a serious thing. Now the ghost, he waits behind the wing, and Polonius, all stained with blood, has forgotten about old Dr. Mud. Only the gravedigger smiles and smirks deep in the grave where he stands and works. Once, not at all in the tragic state, office staff at the water gate glance and look from their office suite at the huge white box across the street but with no idea Hamlet's killed and killers wait in the box with slim bronze pillars, and the rain comes down and dull the day, shedding the dullness, actors play at sorrow and murder and such like things, adulterate beasts and liars and kings. It's really no joke that an actor Shot President Lincoln. No, it's not. And yet we laughed, as actors do, in Hamlet before beginners. Part two. Mm -hmm.